It might be hard to believe now, but spring is approaching. For livestock farmers, this means their animals can finally leave the stables. But it also means danger of diseases transmitted by insects that reappear with the warmth. Blue tongue disease, transmitted by midges, is one example which has in the last two decades regularly harmed animals and farmers' livelihoods in many European countries. Die Landwirte, also die Menschen, leiden darunter, die Tiere leiden darunter. Länder, die Blauzungen frei sind, haben in Ländern, in denen es die Blauzungenkrankheit gibt oder geben könnte, auch keine Zuchttiere mehr gekauft. But help is at hand. A new vaccine has been developed that promises to revolutionize the fight against Blue Tongue. After much debate, the EU has now put in place a framework legislation for its clearance. Because it doesn't use the live virus, it can be used without risk of contagion. The vaccination will be uh, less costly. Uh, for the farmers it will be possibility to reduce uh, their costs, for, for, for example, for the separation vaccinated and uh, no vaccinated animals. And uh, this is the, the, the good news. Member states will still have to incorporate the new rules into national law. But if they do it speedily, it might still just be in time for the upcoming season, as the vaccination has to be applied in early spring. And it might be worth it, not only for reasons of animal welfare. Es wird wirtschaftlich positive Folgen haben für die betroffenen Betriebe, die durch den Krankheitsausbruch in extreme Schwierigkeiten gekommen sind und für die Betriebe, die züchten, 